Not all final bosses are created equal. Some leave us feeling underwhelmed and unsatisfied, while others leave us feeling like champions. So which bosses truly provide the most epic and satisfying conclusion to a complete gaming journey? Let's find out as we embark on a journey to uncover the top 10 most epic video game final boss battles. Before we start our countdown, the top 10 most epic video game boss battles of all time, make sure to hit that subscribe button and turn on those notifications so you don't miss any of our future gaming content. Number 10, Kingdom Hearts 2, Xemnas. Have you played Kingdom Hearts 2? It's such an incredible game with some of the most compelling stories and characters in gaming. The scale of the fight with the boss is just breathtaking. You're jumping and flying around a massive fortress. Slashing your way through enemies as you go, Xemnas is a tough opponent, but the gameplay mechanics are so well designed that you feel like a true hero as you dodge and counter his attacks with precision. And the emotional payoff of the power of friendship ultimately defeating Xemnas is just incredible. It's a finale that truly lives up to the hype and leaves you feeling so satisfied. At number 9, we have God of War 2018 Baldor. If you're a fan of epic boss battles, you have to play God of War 2018. The battle against Baldor, the Norse God of Light, is simply unforgettable. What makes this boss fight so special is the way it's tied into the game's incredible story and characters. Facing off against Baldor feels like a truly epic culmination of their struggles. The fight itself is just incredible with a perfect balance of action and strategy. Baldor is a formidable opponent with a wide variety of moves, and Kratos has to constantly adapt his tactics to stay ahead. It's intense, it's exhilarating, and it's emotionally draining all at the same time. Coming in at number 8, Nier Automata. The Final Boss Rush Automata The Final Boss Rush is not for the faint of heart, as you'll face off against a variety of bosses that will put your gaming skills to the test. Each boss has their own unique attacks and patterns, so you'll need to stay on your toes and be ready for anything. The music and atmosphere during these fights are just incredible, adding to the sense of urgency and adrenaline rush. You'll need to be strategic and adaptable if you want to come out on top. This game is a fitting culmination of the game's incredible story and characters, and it's a moment that will stay with you long after you've put down the controller. If you're a fan of challenging boss battles and emotionally satisfying gameplay experiences, you owe it to yourself to check out this one. Number 7 on our list is Undertale Omega Flowey. Have you ever played Undertale before? It's such a unique gem that really changed the way people talked about games on the internet. Even though it borrows from older games like Earthbound, Undertale has its own style and charm that makes it stand out. One of the most memorable things about Undertale is its first final boss, Flowey. It's so unexpected when you face off against them. Because they were previously a happy and pushy teaching guide, and when you do fight Flowey, they don't even look like themselves. They turn into this bizarre, god-awful monster. It's definitely a surprise you won't forget. Number 6, Fallout the Master. Now let us tell you about Fallout, the iconic post-apocalyptic game from 1997. This game takes place in a world devastated by nuclear war, where players must navigate a harsh wasteland filled with dangers and challenges. One of the most memorable moments in Fallout is the boss fight against the Master, the game's main antagonist. The Master is a mutant seeking to create a new race of super mutants by combining humans with the forced evolutionary virus, FEV. The fight against the Master is a unique and challenging experience, requiring players to navigate a maze-like structure while avoiding traps and enemies. You can choose to fight the Master head-on with weapons and brute force, or use speech and persuasion to convince him to abandon his plans peacefully. There's even a third option in which you can sabotage the Master's plan by destroying the FEV vats, causing them to explode and killing the Master in the process. At number 5, we have Metal Gear Rising, Senator Armstrong. Metal Gear games are known for having some really unique bosses that don't always follow the rules, some bosses with strong themes to bosses that can age to death. Metal Gear bosses are always interesting. Metal Gear Rising is a bit different though, it started out as a sneaky game, but evolved into a character action game. Despite the change in gameplay, it still feels like a Metal Gear game, and the bosses are just as unique and crazy as ever. Senator Armstrong is a standout villain in Metal Gear Rising. He's both a strong villain and a good person, which makes him all the more interesting to fight. 
That final fight against him is just insane, with both of you tearing each other to pieces while he yells crazily. It's definitely a battle that's hard to forget. Taking the number 4 spot is Majora's Mask, Majora. Majora, the final boss of Majora's Mask, is an incredibly memorable and well-designed boss that perfectly captures the essence of the game's dark and surreal atmosphere. What makes Majora so unique is its three different forms, each with its own distinct fighting style and abilities. The battle is fast-paced and intense, with Majora constantly changing up its tactics and keeping you on your toes. But what really makes this final boss so special is the emotional weight behind it. Throughout the game, you've been on a journey to save the world and its inhabitants from Majora's Wrath, and the final battle brings everything to a head in a truly epic way. It is a testament to the game's incredible storytelling, characters, and design. It's a fitting end to a game that is often regarded as one of the best in the Zelda series. And it's definitely a boss fight that'll stay with you for a long time after you've beaten it. Moving to number 3, Devil May Cry 3, Virgil. Devil May Cry is a series that started out as a prototype for Resident Evil 4, but has since become its own thing with some of gaming's most famous characters. Dante and his brother Virgil are two of the most beloved characters in gaming, and they're both demon-slaying badasses. Virgil's been around since the beginning of DMC, and in DMC 3, he's almost like a backstory for everyone. You end up fighting him more than once, but the final fight against him is really something special. Virgil wants to fight again to show he's stronger, and it's just a small thing, but it makes the fight that much more exciting. The thing that really sets this final fight apart, though, is that both you and the boss have gotten stronger over the course of the game. So when you finally face off against Virgil at the end, it's an epic battle between two equals. You can feel the tension and excitement as you go toe-to-toe -to -toe with one of gaming's most iconic villains. At number 2, we have Shadow of the Colossus, Malice. Shadow of the Colossus is a masterpiece of a game that has inspired countless others, yet none have quite captured the emotional highs that it achieves. From the stunning open fields to the gargantuan enemies that you climb, everything about this game is breathtaking. One of the most interesting aspects of Shadow of the Colossus is the way it makes you feel about what you're doing. In your quest to save someone else, you hunt down 16 colossi, deeming their lives less important than that of the one you're trying to save. It's a morally complex situation that adds an extra layer of depth to the game. The final Colossus Malice is a fitting end to the journey. It's not an epic showdown, but rather a somber acceptance of the great sin that you've committed. As you climb and battle the Colossus, you have plenty of time to contemplate your actions and the consequences that have led to this moment. Our number one choice is Final Fantasy VII Sephiroth. Final Fantasy VII is one of the most beloved games of all time, and its final boss fight against Sephiroth is legendary. Sephiroth is one of the most iconic villains in gaming, and his presence looms over the entire game. The final battle against him is nothing short of epic, with stunning visuals, an incredible score, and intense action that will keep you on the edge of your seat. What really makes it our number one is the emotional weight behind it. Throughout the game, you've been on a journey to stop Sephiroth and save the world from his destructive plans. The final battle brings everything to a head in a way that is both thrilling and deeply satisfying. But it's not just the gameplay and the story that makes the boss fight amazing. The music is absolutely stunning with the iconic one-winged angel theme that perfectly captures the intensity of the battle. So what do you think? Which of the boss battles we featured in this video was your favorite? Let us know in the comment box. That's all for today. We hope you enjoyed our selection and that it brought back some fond memories of your favorite gaming moments. Thanks for watching.